tonight, more options could be on the way for your child's education. A Valley teacher is starting a charter school from scratch, and it could be open sooner than you think. 13 Action News reporter David Schumann has more on this ambitious project. Spend just a few minutes with Justin Brecht, and his passion for teaching bleeds through. Now he's taking that and trying to do something stunning. Start a school from nothing. The opportunity to provide a quality education for a community, for a parent, for a child is, yeah, there is no better work. He's planning Nevada Rise Academy as a public charter school for K through five. It's about creating another option at no cost to parents. Some students have not only access to quality schools, but multiple options for quality schools. Some students do not, and Nevada Rise Academy seeks to close that equity gap. I think it's a great idea that he gets to start in such young children because he's aiming towards the future. The academy is still just a brainchild. Justin's in the middle of applying for state funding. Yet he says he has signatures from 150 parents who are interested. From the ones we spoke to, that's all about their faith in him. I've known him for over three years now, and he, he has such a positive feedback for my children. Justin taught in the Clark County School District for 13 years. He wants his school to emphasize parent involvement. So he's asking them directly for their ideas and input. What do you want to see in a school for your child? If you were on the groundbreaking phases of education, what would you want to have in a school that's being built for your community, for your child? The plan is to open in the fall of 2018 with five classrooms for kindergarten and first grade. Now an obvious question is why would a parent choose to send their child to a school that's virtually a startup versus something more established like CCSD? At 6, I'll tell you more about Justin's specific plans to differentiate his academy from everything else that's out there. David Schumann, 13 Action News.